Hello my name is Gadam. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to give you guys a list of the top 5 best female fragrances or perfumes that I've smelled so far this year. Start off with an honorable mention. So at number 6, this doesn't really count. So at number 6, I'm going to talk about Viva La Bubbly, which is a great fragrance that I've smelled recently, but I haven't tested or heard anything about someone who's actually worn it through time to be able to like really tell me about the fragrance but from the first sniff it smelled really good it's like a very like you know if you've ever went to bath and body works the champagne toast fragrance it's kind of like that but a bit higher quality than their mist so basically it's like champagne smell so a bit of like you know booziness but like a fresh fruity booziness with some berries inside a bit of vanilla it's very fresh and fruity with a bit of a, like a nice sweet ambery dry down so that's the honorable mention which is viva la bubbly by viva la juicy couture whatever i don't even know man you'll see the picture at number five you have rihanna's rebel fleur which is a really great fragrance that you can get for like around 30 dollars this fragrance smells really nice very good projection and sillage definitely wherever you're gonna walk people are gonna smell you so the sound profile you'll smell like coconut bit of peach or is it plum i believe but some vanilla amber tonka bean in the base it's a bit tropical but it's not super fruity it's very smooth it smells way better than it's supposed to be well not really that it's supposed to be but it smells better than the price that it comes for and it's been very hyped by jeremy fragrance which is the reason why i bought it for my sister she really enjoyed it even my mother very great fragrance for women that are cheap if you need to buy fragrances as a gift came to the right video model sucker because i'm gonna bless you with great fragrances to give to your sisters your wives all of them so <laughs> number four on the list is none other than the gabbana light blue for women it's a very nice fragrance fresh it has citrus it's kind of like the light blue for men but a bit dumb down a bit added florals inside and less extreme saltiness which i think is really nice even myself personally i think i would wear it myself because it's very nice i think it's not super feminine but at the same time it just smells clean and fresh and sometimes women want to smell fresh and clean you know you can bring it to the gym everyday casual scent it's not super dominant it's not the most long lasting but it smells nice fresh and clean and that's sometimes all you need in a fragrance so now we're up to the top three so if you got this far in the video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It takes a lot of effort to be doing these videos. So support Amanda, because we're doing it for the Gyadam this time. <laughs> so at number three on this list is none other than Swiss Arabian's Shagaf Oud. This fragrance is really nice. I recently reviewed it. I gifted it to my mom. It's a very lactonic, praline Oud fragrance with some rose very smooth very strong and powerful dominant it's a unisex fragrance but i think it smells better on a woman because of the lactonic vibes the praline chocolatey caramelized smells that it comes with with that rose anyone can pull it off but honestly i think it really is good on a boss woman someone who wants to dominate any industry she's in she walks into the room she's a boss a queen of egypt type of thing you know what i'm saying that fragrance is for you I put it at number three because it's not the most appealing to everyone. It's kind of challenging, but the smell, the quality is out of this earth. It's out of this world. It smells really nice, really high quality. Performance is exceptional. So if you want something strong, powerful, oud, but you're a feminine woman and you want to smell like a woman, definitely try out Swiss Arabian's Shagaf Oud, which comes on number three on the list. So on number two, for the second position on my list, I give it to... Givenchy's L'Interdit Eau de Parfum. I saw a lot of reviews about this and I heard it first from Demi Rowling. She really hyped it up as well as L'Interdit Rouge, which I didn't really smell, so I can't really talk about it. But the Eau de Parfum is an exceptional fragrance. It has like some type of fruity plum peach in the opening. And then it goes like a bit musky floral with the jasmine in the mid. And then it has some like patchouli and vanilla type of cedar and the like base very nice very feminine fragrance loud as well i don't know why but a lot of these feminine fragrances have just amazing sillage which is a good thing i guess 
to attract people but at the same time you don't want to attract everyone because certain people are not the ones you're trying to attract you know what i'm saying i know the sisters also want to attract certain people so you know this is the type of fragrance you want to wear when you want to dress up or just casually or when you go out it's that type of fragrance it's like very good sillage good performance as well pricing also is not too bad you can get it for around 80 90 bucks for what you're getting i think it's worth it because of the performance quality everything so you should definitely check out that fragrance sample it if you can and trust me it's gonna do you really really good now first one on the list is a great fragrance that i really love i never tried the actual real one but i tried an oil perfumery one that i gifted to someone very special and on them it just smelled amazing it's intoxicating i loved it so much and it's part from the marley's delina i think that fragrance is amazing it has this very unique lychee top note which is very fruity it smells amazing and then you get to some white floral musky notes in the mid and then in the base that's when you get some like vanilla amber and a lot of other things vetivers and it's such a classy fragrance it smells very timeless it's like those chanel number no. five timeless types of fragrances but also it can just transcend generations and ages doesn't matter how old you are or what you do but if you wear that fragrance you're gonna smell amazing no one's gonna complain and everybody's gonna just love being around you because it's intoxicating it smells so good and i just loved it and i got the oil perfumery one which is like around 30 50 bucks not more than that you get like a little 10 ml roller that you can place on your wrist and stuff and it performed pretty well so that's what i tried and i really liked and i'm pretty sure that it wouldn't be too far off of the real deal because i've tried oil perfumery a lot i might make videos on them too because it's been a while and i never made a video on that company but that's one of the ones that made me start out my fragrance journey so i'm definitely going to talk about them soon but yes that oil perfumery was just amazing so i'm sure with no shadow of a doubt that the original perfume the marlis delina would be as amazing if not better so if you can get it sample it try it out and you will not regret getting it because i am sure it will get you so many compliments and you will just feel like a boss you'll feel amazing and that's the type of fragrance that can get you a husband i'm telling you straight up like that's the type of thing when i sell out gee, i would take shorty out on a freaking dubai trip all expenses paid man this that that's that's that type of fragrance that just deserves a ring on the finger you know what i'm saying my future wife if you're seeing this video you better get that because if you don't have that type of smell i might not even get attracted to you to be honest because smell is that type of thing that really can attract a person it's memorable people will remember you from your smell so make sure you smell good you're looking good and you're feeling good thank you for watching my video again press a like comment and subscribe have a great day night and or evening and as you know it Peace.